Big shark. What is going on guys? It is a beautiful day today. It's hot, it's not very windy, and I'm seeing a lot of mullet, I'm seeing a lot of fish. So we're gonna go ahead, see if we can get some of those mullet and throw out some live mullet, see what we can get on that. Maybe a shark, a redfish or something, and then obviously for some gar as well. So let's see how we can do. And look what we got. Hold up, hold up, it's stuck. Give me one second. Check out what we caught. Oh, nice size needlefish. He's all stuck in the, in the net, but that's cool. I haven't seen one of those in a while. I actually caught one of these in the Bahamas when I was 11. That was actually a potential world record. It was like five and a half feet long. It was ridiculous. The gator's checking me out. Swim off, needlefish. Yes. There we go. Getting my cast net unstuck. We caught a little gar. He's got his teeth stuck in the net. It's all tore up. Oh, come on. All right, we're gonna go ahead and send out one whole, semi-whole mullet. Just like that. And we're gonna get that out in the opening of this canal. Oh, mullet, there's mullet. No way, no way. I've been trying to throw the cast net and trying to catch bait for so long. I need those mullet. I got some, I got some. I got it, Tom. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. Okay. We're good. We got four. All righty. Let's put one on live. Alrighty, that is what we're throwing out. I'm using wire today because there is a good chance of sharks. As y'all saw, we already caught a needlefish. It's brackish water. Probably. Actually, no, there's the little. Yeah, I see the look of it. I don't know. They rolled down. If that doesn't catch a gar, I don't know what will. Yeah. Only thing I'm worried about is that crab trap. Yeah, I'm not worried about this one. This one has a lot of line with the other ones, yeah. Because especially a shark, sharks go very quickly. They, they usually go and then stop and then just like keep going and gar consistent. Yeah, gar consistent runs. Oh, he stopped now, there he goes. No way. It's big. It's very big. Dude, it's huge. I can't even move it. I see it, I see it is a shark. It's a big shark. Yeah, I'm letting it go down. Oh, I almost smoked you, my bad. Nice shark. I'm a, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll figure it out. I'm gonna get him. Nice shark. I don't want to grab him by the tail because he, he'll probably tear my arm open. Yeah. 
I'm gonna drag him over and then I'll rope him over here. Dude, he, he was pulling hard. Uh, it's on, it's in my bag. I'll get it. Oh, he came off. Eh, I count that as a catch. Yeah. Uh. All right, guys, we've caught six bull sharks so far. I forgot my GoPro, but I'm going to go ahead and start filming because I think there's a lot more to be caught. I literally can't move them. That was on the blue hill. Yep. Look like this guy's luck anyway. Yeah, I know the kids. That's a nice one. I don't want him to see it. Yell at him. Nah. You want to try to bring her around? I'm going to just pick him up on the tail. Alright. Oh, we got to grab the tail. I got him. Oh, there you go. Go. <laughs> Alright, let's get him back. Yeah. Yeah, I'm videoing right now. We're good. Oh, that's so sick. With the sunset, too. All right, you guys, that concludes this video. I actually filmed this video quite a while back and I never got around to editing it just cause I didn't think I had enough footage. Cause like I said, I forgot my GoPro. Uh, I had to walk a long ways to get to the spot. I realized I didn't have it. So I just didn't feel like getting it. But then we started catching shark after shark. So I had my buddy McCade and film me catching one. And that was one of, I think eight sharks total. And literally, we didn't hook into a single gar, which is crazy to me because always it's constant bites from gar. It was like the sharks replaced the gar for one day and that's it. Uh, I don't know if the mama bull sharks were coming in and laying their pups and they were just like ravenous because we literally caught them on bluegill and shad and anything we could catch in the cast net, they were biting. So that was awesome. But I have a sick video coming up. I will be posting that as soon as possible. But as always, thanks for watching and I will see you all in the next fishing video.